My name is Eric and my business is called Cutworks. I was primarily welding, doing odd jobs here and there for breweries, stainless welding, doing signs and whatnot. And then I had a few projects where I needed to glue up some tabletops, so got the tools that I needed, started that side of things very slowly. And about that time, I saw Origin, used it, ended up buying one, and ever since then, now have incorporated pretty much most of my projects have been wood and steel combo. At first, I, I didn't really, really see the potential, but the more I researched it and saw that I could cut large things in my small little shop, that really kind of got me thinking on, on what I could do. So my first project was a coffee table that was four feet long, had a waterfall edge, so it was another two feet. So over six feet, I cut a curve and both panels fit right together. And after that happened, then, you know, <laughs> I can, there's so much more I can do. And so uh, big projects have really uh, lend itself to being in this shop now. My workflow is everything goes into the Fusion 360 and making sure that I've got correct proportions, dimensions, that's, that's where all of that kind of gets sorted out here. And then I'm um, pretty confident once it goes into the tool. Like for the merch display, I'll model the individual components and make sure that they fit together. And I output each component, go over to my hub, drop them in, and then it goes right to origin. It's really quick, especially even not cutting the entire project and just cutting the mating features to make sure that that works well and that I didn't miss anything. That's, that's really super fast to do on the, on the tool. When you show up with something, even though it's not the final thing, when you have a thing that fits their aesthetic, then yeah, to show up with that, that's, that's when they're, oh, okay, you know, we know uh, that, that you know what you're doing. And they have, definitely have more confidence going in and, and spending the four or five, six thousand dollars in the final version, especially since they've seen a, a prototype that's, that's of quality and fits their aesthetics. People got to see, you know, from putting shaper tape down to actually having a sign that I carried out of the shop uh, in one day. It was, that's pretty cool. And to have it all in house too. So it was something I didn't have to sub out, something I didn't have to manage somebody else doing. I would send that out. It was often really painful too because, you know, everybody uses different file formats. So there's uh, emails bouncing back and forth and, you know, the job isn't getting done. <laughs> just, just cut it, please. So once it got cut, often you know there's no dramas, but you don't have the luxury of doing test fittings. There's mating components. You're kind of at the mercy of the person cutting the part or your design, not overlooking anything. So that was always nerve-wracking, and if there was a mistake, you know, pay for it. So <laughs> you had to do it again. <laughs> so it was cool to be able to to kind of uh, get those details sorted first. The tool was working for me, so that was nice. I have taken Origin to a job. We ended up cutting, it was a sign for my hardwood supplier, and um, they had taken care of the metal lettering, but they had this slab that they wanted to donate for the sign, and so the slab was something that they couldn't really sell because it had a really large check in it, so I brought uh, Origin to them. They wanted to check it out anyway. We cut some butterflies and tossed them into the slab, and they ended up using it. It was neat to have that ability to instead of loading up a large piece of wood, risk damaging the slab, bringing it into your shop, cutting it, then delivering it back, you can just bring the tool to it. It's kind of a cool wow factor. And the footprint, I just can't, like right now the scale that I'm at, sending out metal cutting is still my only option. When I get a little bigger, then I can start cutting steel, CNC steel cutting in here. But for now, having CNC wood cutting capability in, a, uh, in the size of a, a suitcase is pretty nice. <laughs> to be able to bring out the capability at will, use it, and then put it away and not have the hindrance of it still lying around is worth the money right there. 